Hello, Cheese and welcome back to episode 28 of Xenonauts. Um, we are going to start today's episode by transferring some soldiers over to the Florida Man Base because we had a whole bunch. We took three privates from there and brought them over here, so we have to send some soldiers back. So we're sending some of the senior leadership to uh, hold down the fort over at Florida Man Base. In the meantime, this Charlie helicopter is coming back from the mission we just finished, and this should be uh, somebody shot down over here. If they can catch them, nope, no time, had to come back. Um, but we could send that same helicopter from Florida Man Base out to do a mission with Blue Flare, Kelsey, Scotty, Yargle, T-Rex, Mango, Mind Control, and Yo Vivo. Uh, no. <laughs> Pokemon references. Uh, we can send this out over here because they're landed and hopefully it'll be daytime by the time we get there. Uh, everyone's grounded over there, so we can't shoot that down just yet. Uh, if it's not going to be daytime, return to the base. I want to make sure we have a daytime mission. Okay, there we go. Uh, production of a Corsair. So we finished our other Corsair here, which means we should be able to go shoot this down pretty easily. A single Corsair against a small UFO should be just fine. <laughs> We're going to have a little mission over here. Oh, no. Are you kidding me? They took off after they established an outpost. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, Charlie, select new target. I guess you're going to try and land on this base, but you're just going to get shot down on the way there now. Um, well, we'll let that go at very, very slow speed. We'll see if this Corsair goes and finds stuff. Oh, I'm so worried about the soldiers on that ship. I guess it's a good thing we transferred some new... Oh, some new people. We've got some Foxtrots and Condors, so let's send them out to maybe intercept that so that the Charlie can have a safe flight home. So those soldiers did not know what they were getting into when they left, uh, but it looks like we're going to attack another base with a relatively new crew. Oh. All right, Yo Vivo's first combat mission here. Um, definitely going to be an interesting one. So we do have a couple of heavies for this base, uh, which is going to be nice. Yargle, uh, this one kind of nice, only one door out. So uh, we can get Yo Vivo there with the shotgun, mind control with a shotgun. Uh, T-Rex with a shotgun. So you got a whole lot of privates um, making their way out. Oh, we have three heavies. So two rocket launchers. I don't know about rocket launchers in this corridor. I think we want everyone to start with their machine guns out rather than their rocket launchers. Um, who else do we have? Blue Flare, Senior over here, and Yargle with the, uh, the rifle there. All right. It's going to be the most stressful base assault that we've done so far. Okay, looks clear, but we can't close that door. Yargle, scout ahead. Anything in this room that we can see? Clear and clear. Okay, but uh, no need to get ahead of ourselves, right? Let's just hang out in here. Uh, just get stay behind cover over here. That's, that's going to be it. So let's just get uh, some of our people with shotguns up and into the room. Yeah, you guys can make it all the way up to some cover over here. Uh, mind control can get right here. And crouch. Oh, good to know this door on this side is locked. So it's only those two doors on that end. Which is really solid for us because we can actually put uh, some machine gunners in place way at the back. Uh, Mango can get over here. Uh, Kelsey can get over here. T-Rex is going to get right up there and crouch. Don't like you guys being up in front without being crouched down. Um, and Blue Flare is our sniper. We're going to see if we can't keep you maybe tucked away in behind uh, Yo Vivo over here. Uh, Scotty, you can move up even a little bit further. Yeah, just to here is fine. I don't expect anyone to come out those doors, but uh, you never know. 
Yargle becoming unnerved there. So we took down this out, or we attacked the outpost within, like, you know, very, very quickly after it was formed. So that should bode well for uh, us. Let's just double check, but yeah, okay, all clear over there. Alright, so that's Mind Control and T-Rex. Uh, crouch down behind the cover that you're in over there. Um, as for this other side, we're going to get Scotty and there's another machine gunner, Kelsey, on this door, ready to lay down some cover fire. Um, same thing, we're going to try and actually move Mind Control off to the side a little bit so that... Uh, Mango. Uh, okay, so we gotta move Yargle first. Yargle, you just get over here. So we can get Mango right here. Uh, Blue Flare is gonna hang out right here with your sniper. And Yo Vivo, we're not sure which direction we're gonna send you in, so we're actually just gonna stand you uh, just kind of in the middle right now, ready to go one way or the other. Alright. Whew, okay, mind control gets unnerved, but that's okay. Now, YoVivo has lots of uh, time units, so you can actually run in there and open the door. And there we go, we spotted an alien. So, Mango can lay down some cover fire. Not great chances, 9% times 10. Maybe let's get YoVivo a little, uh, little out of the way, just up here. Nothing. Oh, there is another one over there. Well... Uh, lay down your cover fire first, Mango. Ah, oh, you got him and he's suppressed. Great, okay. So, uh... We're still not gonna move Yo Vivo just yet. We're gonna see if we can't do the same thing over here on the other side. With, uh, Blue Flare opening the door. Still only two people spotted. And Kelsey does not have a line to that guy, so move up a little bit. Move up a little bit more. Okay, you do have a shot on him from here. So Blue Flare now is just going to get out of the way so that Kelsey can lay down some cover fire. 11% times 10. Manages to shoot Blue Flare. But we also suppress this guy, so that's okay. Uh, Scotty. Scotty's not able to suppress from here. Uh, so we're just going to move up this side and wait. Yargle, if Kelsey... No, Kelsey can't get out of your way. Yargle, get a shot from here. You can get a snapshot off. Huh. This room got messy really quickly. Um... Alright, well... Let's get T-Rex to start moving in. Gonna be moving up along that side. So this is not a door that we can shut. Uh, a normal shot from here does almost nothing on either of them. 23, no. Or what are we looking at if we move over to this side? 13, 16, 19. You can walk to here with a snapshot. That just doesn't seem worth it. 30% across the room. Um... Yeah, crouch up to 36. We'll just take that shot across the room with Yo Vivo. All right, one of your shots landed. That's fine. T-Rex uh, is going to have to stay where you are. Mind Control is going to have to get up into that room eventually. But Yargle is going to have to move first. Yargle, maybe take a normal shot. 18%. Go for it. Oh. Nope, just kidding. Um... Get to here and crouch. Don't worry about it. Mind control now. Still sort of in the same boat. A long run to get over to that other side. So mind control is just going to get to here for now. Get ready to run in there and do something. And Mango doesn't have any movement left either. Who's left? Scotty. Yeah, Scotty can't really get anywhere. Scotty's going to stay right here. Perfect. This guy firing across the room instead of at the soldiers that are right next to them. Okay. That's fine. Those uh, flying UFOs. Oh, these doors do shut? 
I mean, it's kind of a pain for us. Um, Yovivo, mind control. So Yovivo is actually just going to open this door for people. Get out of the way. So that mind control can maybe come... Yeah, just shoot this guy. Uh, yep. There you go. Mind control puts him down. Now, where did the other guys go is the question. So we know that one thing flew in over here. Yargle is relatively unnoyed, unnerved. Hey, dragon! Uh, okay, no shots from right here, and I don't think we're going to be able to do anything. Close the door, crouch behind some cover, and just look at the door for now. Uh, we're going to have to get people up into position. Mango's got a bit of a run to get over there. T-Rex is going to be able to hold a normal shot if that door opens, which it probably will. And who's left? Kelsey. Uh, so Kelsey's going to have a machine gun fire to lay down. Uh, she'll be able to step around this corner and fire in this direction. And same thing with Scotty, I believe. Except uh, Scotty... Oh, found a guy on the far side of the room. Which is going to be just fine. We're going to get into cover here. And just get ready to move this way. Same thing with Kelsey. And I think that's everyone. Alright, so hopefully T-Rex can... Uh, uh, we're, we're invading a base. Uh, so this is an alien base that we're trying to, to go fight. Yeah. Bit of transferring some soldiers around. Okay. I mean, good reaction shot, T-Rex, but, uh... Okay, uh, you're fine. T-Rex, just fine. Okay. Yeah, okay, a little bit of damage, but nothing too dramatic. Someone went down. We'll check who that was here in a second. Uh, Blue Flare panicked, even though Blue Flare is nowhere near the action. Looks like Yargle. Yargle went down. Um... Let's see, Yo Vivo, can you be the hero here? Yes, you can. Yo Vivo taking something down. Hey, Panda, welcome, welcome. Uh, seventy percent, or what are we looking at? Thirty-two. Uh, we can get two shots at seventy percent. Only needs one. T Rex taking him down. Alright, so we know there's one guy left on the far side of the room. Let's see if we can't get a shot on him. Uh, so it's not going to be with Scotty or Kelsey. They're just not going to have the movement, I think. Uh, yeah, Yargle, uh, Yargle took a bit of a shot to the face there. Now, okay, so the last guy is tucked up in that corner. Um, T-Rex, peek into this room. Looks all clear. Close the door. Keep an eye out up this uh, corridor. So let's just get our machine gunners in place to do something next turn, maybe? What kind of path? Oh, it comes out the other side. Uh, yeah, Mango's not going to have movement to do all of this. But he could get the jump on him next turn. Same thing with Kelsey. If we just stand next to this teleporter and then go, um, we could jump on him from there. And if he comes through, uh, Mind Control could just shoot him with a reaction fire. Uh... So, Scotty, we're actually just going to get over here. Um, and I think that's going to be it. Kelsey, Scotty, Mind Control, and Mango. Yeah, you guys are all just going to run through there next turn. That's fine. There's a couple of doors. Alright, so Mango can actually step through here. And hold your burst fire. Where did he go? I just assumed that uh, Mango would have a shot on him when he stepped through. Scotty? There he is. Alright, Scotty. 33% times 10. Great job, Scotty. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Okay. Walk right up. Unload your entire machine gun clip into his face. Uh, so Mango doesn't need to hold a shot. Mango's just going to check out this door for us. Uh, it's the power source, I believe. So close that door, just hang out there for now. 
We'll get the rest of the team to join you. So, Blue Flare, grab that sniper, stop panicking, um, and come join the rest of the team. Uh, okay, now let's maybe head down this corridor with more people. Yovivo has uh, definitely put in some work so far. Okay, we found someone. Where are they? Way down there. Okay. Um, are we ready to go take them on? T-Rex. Anything else in this room? No. Uh, yeah, you're not you're not gonna get down there just yet. But if it's only that guy down there, we can actually start getting into this room and getting ready for him to come around that corner. Um, like so. Yep, Yargle's the one who died so far. Uh, mind control, we're gonna send you with that shotgun squad that went into the other room there. Uh, no, just kidding. We're gonna have mind control join people over on this side. Mind control, scout out this room. All clear. That's actually, uh, really good for us. Because it means we can start setting up, uh, to go through this door rather than waiting in this room for a turn. Uh, which means Blue Flare will probably be over on this corner. Mango will just get you in there with that uh, machine gun. Kelsey, same deal. Just get in there. Get ready to lay down some cover fire on this, uh, this door. And uh, I think that's everyone. So we sent a squad of four this way and a squad of three this way. No, wait. A squad of two that way. Scotty's just sort of in that room by themselves. Well, Privates, Yovivo, and T-Rex... <laughs> uh, that's fine that's fine I like the blue shirts because they just can't aim I think Yargle was a senior officer too weren't they? yeah Lieutenant Yargle they hadn't died yet they'd been on a number of missions alright T-Rex where'd he go? Uh, I don't see him Oh, he's right there. Okay. Well, uh, 31, 36. Oh. <laughs> uh, okay, so one normal shot from behind with Yo Vivo. Take him down, 95%. Oh, it's not enough damage, though. Yo Vivo takes some return fire there. But uh, don't worry, his buddy T Rex is here to back him up with one snapshot, 50%. Great job, T-Rex. T-Rex, Yo Vivo, the dream team we need. Uh, taking them down over here. All right, the rest of the squad. Um, Blue Flare, probably not the one we want opening the door with the sniper rifle, but uh, you go for it. Because then Kelsey can light them up. 29% times 10. Perfect. Looks like we're probably going to meet up in some room down here after we finish clearing. Uh, and Kelsey, just walk on ahead, because this corridor looks like it's going to be pretty clear. We'll get, uh, move into these alcoves as we go. Mind control leading the charge as well. Probably going to be clear. There's a doorway here we're going to wait on the side of. Maybe peek in there. Okay, yeah, good, good. Just another door. Uh, that means we can get Blue Flare into here. Probably crouch behind it just in case. And Mango, we can run all the way over here, bring that machine gun fire. Who's left? Scotty. Scotty will send with the two privates. Lieutenant Scotty backing him up. Lots of time units to catch up to these two. <laughs> um, okay, let's see. T-Rex, let's get you in there. What can you spot? Nothing so far, hey? Alright, Private T-Rex says it is all clear. And Yovivo decides to follow him in there. Also all clear. Okay. Okay. I mean, it's good. We'll take an all clear room. It's a little bit scary that there's nothing in here. Probably means that the squad over on this side has to deal with some stuff. But uh, we've cleared every room and every door we've entered so far. So, mind control. Mmm... Let's have Blue Flare probably switch over to that shotgun to help out. And uh, go open this door. Oh, we found a guy right here. That's actually pretty easy for us. Mind control, put him down. Um, easy one shot to the face. And open the door. 
Uh, looks clear. Okay, we don't want to... Okay, room is clear, room is clear. Good, 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 good. Uh, just crouch here, mind control. Uh, so mind control is just going to keep an eye on that door for us. Blue flare can get down here and open this one. Which also looks all clear with a red door. Didn't we see a red door over here? Yeah, we saw a red door over here, so we have to kind of go in and around to get there. Alright, well, who's left? Kelsey with that machine gun, you can get to the door. And Mango with the machine gun will also get to the door. And close it for now. Okay, we're still hearing movement. Yeah, this base, they got it set up pretty quickly. Um, let's see. Mind control, peek into this room for us. I think it is going to be, yeah, the same room that the crew over here is in, which is great. I'm glad people are meeting up. Okay, all clear so far. Yo, Vivo, run down that center column. Um, anything on the other side? Okay, all clear over on this side as well, hey? Hmm. I mean, I don't like that. That's uh, That feels a little too suspicious. But, uh, mind control, just take a peek down. Oh, mind control. Oh, no. Um, all right, Kelsey, can we get over there? No, it's a solid wall between us and them. Oh, no, okay, mind control, uh, you're bleeding as well. Back up and close that door. There's going to be a body somewhere. Uh, okay, how do we get to that guy? Scotty can hold a burst shot. I don't think we can take reaction fire with machine guns. I don't think that's a thing that you do. Alright, T-Rex just kind of getting in this corner. Gonna run up that way eventually. Um, everyone else, this is an empty room here, which I'm not a huge fan of. Uh, so we're just gonna get everyone on the same teleporters ready to go. Yeah, we definitely saw an alien over here, but nothing we can do about that right now. Just gonna get Scotty on that corner. They'll step out and start firing. Mind Control is gonna have to grab their med kit and fix themselves. Yo Vivo keeping an eye on this door, but no reaction fire. Blue Flare, step through this teleporter. Alien? Where? Oh, there's a drone right there. Uh, don't like that. Um step back through yeah okay all these teleporters probably go to the same room but uh, no need for us to go through just yet we're gonna have everybody with machine guns ready to go through next turn yeah there he is oh what a miss okay that's good for us yeah we know mind control is bleeding but uh, we'll be able to fix that pretty quickly Scotty though 46% times 10 Take him down. Great job, Scotty. Uh, almost out of machine gun ammo, though. Gonna have to switch over to that rocket launcher soon. Mind control is gonna patch themselves up here. Just put your gun down for one second. Take out your med kit. Patch yourself up. And then you can do the opposite. Pick up your gun. And come join the team. Oh, yeah. We can hear the footsteps in the background, which is pretty funny. Okay, Mango, step through. Immediately get shot. But then you got, uh, what, 35 time units, so hold your time units. Uh, step to here. You got 10% times 10. Alright, Mango, not good enough. Uh, next person, who else do we have? Blue Flare, Kelsey. Uh, Kelsey can only go here and still have... Uh, Shots with Mango definitely in the way though. 53%. Alright, 8% times 10. Okay, Kelsey, that's all your ammo too. Oh man, Mango. Uh, you might be in a bit of trouble unless Blue Flare can get there and help you with two snapshots from here. Crouch. Maybe one good shot. That's not good enough. Alright. Yeah, aliens behind you. Do you hear the steps? Alright, Yovivo. Anything through this door? 
Looks like a corridor. Uh, okay, there is an alien down there. Just uh, come back and wait on this door for the rest of the team. And we're going to get... Uh, Scotty's going to take their time, but uh, T-Rex should be able to join you on that door pretty quickly. Mind Control will be backing you up, but the other three are probably going to be in a bit of trouble here. Oh, there was an alien actually behind us. Hold on, Blue Flare didn't die? Was that another one? Oh, man. Mango's bleeding from two different wounds. Is there two of them here? Is there only one? Oh, Mango is suppressed and can't take a shot. Uh, Blue Flare's got one shot. Okay, Blue Flare takes that one down. And then spots the other alien in this corner, but Kelsey is out of ammo. Mango doesn't have enough reaction to fire. Mango also doesn't have a first aid kit. Uh, all Blue Flare can do is stand up for now. Blue Flare is going to have to run over and shoot this guy. Kelsey doesn't have a first aid kit either. Kelsey, take out that stun rod and run over there and pray that you have enough to stun him to the ground. You got two smacks though. There we go, we stunned him to the ground. Oh. But uh, nobody here has a first aid kit? Blue Flare does. So Mango will have two hit points and we'll be able to heal him next turn. It's a tough little room for us. All right, but that means uh, the rest of the crew here should be ready to go on this door. T-Rex can go catch up. Mind Control ready to join the assault team over here. I think this is the last direction we can head. Um, where's the other team? Yeah, that door was locked, so this should be the final room now that the uh, the team over there is heading to. Mango should live. Uh, yo, Vivo can open the door. Maybe take a shot around that corner? Uh, where'd he go? Oh, there's two of them now. Uh, Mango, you got enough to throw this? You do. All right, Mango, lob a grenade down there, maybe. You might take some uh, reaction fire, but uh, yo, Vivo, maybe 50%. Maybe that grenade is going to be good enough. Okay, Yovivo takes some reaction fire. But uh, who's got some movement left? Pretty much no one. We're going to move the team in behind you. Everybody's here backing you up, Yovivo. But uh, unless that grenade goes off first, and I'm not sure what the order of operations is. Hopefully that grenade explodes and just takes them both down. It explodes and takes neither of them down. Okay, Yovivo goes down. Yep, yep, we know Mango is bleeding, but we have... Yeah, Mango, don't pan... Don't run too far. Mango. Blue Flare's gotta come fix Mango. Where's Blue Flare? Okay, Blue Flare, get out that first aid kit. Run over there. Patch him up. What was that? What was that? You smacked him with the first aid kit and that was it? Oh no. So because Mango panicked and ran away, we're not able to get to him in time with the first aid kit and Mango's gonna bleed out on the floor. Uh, all right. All right, well that's too bad. Not enough movement to get to him in time. Okay, where's the rest of the team? Yeah. Scotty, step around that corner. Scotty, just live. All we need is for you to unload a machine gun clip into this guy. So hold your burst fire. Walk towards him menacingly. Unload your clip. All right, where's the other guy gone? T-Rex, uh, if he's in there, you're going to go get him. He's not there. He's not there. He must have gone back into the other room, I guess. Yeah, it, it makes the punch noise, right? All right, mind control, uh, gonna get right up close to the door, holding a snapshot into the room. Kelsey, I mean, there's a soldier there. They have a precision plasma that we could pick up and use, but um, I mean, don't worry about it. Just take out your rocket launcher and just wait for now. You just don't have the time units. We uh, we can't fix Mango. That's really too bad. Mango bleeds out because they panicked. I mean, can we still use the uh, medkit on them here? Blue flare? Can you try? 
<laughs> All right, Blue Flare tried to fix up Mango, but uh, Mango was running away too much. It's probably time for us to start marching Blue Flare back uh, to catch up with everyone else. It's gonna be a bit of a walk though. Probably Mind Control will just take down the last guy wherever he went. Yeah, he ran away to right here. It's gonna be two snapshots. There we go, Mind Control. Oh, there's another guy on the other side. Um, T-Rex? T-Rex can have like one normal shot from here. Hold your normal shot, look this way. Nope, it's gonna be one snapshot. So hold your snapshot and walk towards him. 50%. Oh, T-Rex. Okay, Scotty, switch that rocket launcher. If uh, if nothing else, the rocket launcher will come and save you all. Kelsey, uh, probably just gonna sit tight there and make sure that that alien does not wake up again. Uh, and that's gonna be most of what's going on. Blue Flare is trying to catch up. Oh, that's good. All misses by a blue shirt in this corner. And final kill, great job T-Rex. Just take him down. There we go. Looks like we lost Yargle, Yo Vivo, Mango, but Kelsey gets the promotion to Lieutenant, Mind Control makes it to Sergeant, and T-Rex gets promoted to Corporal. Badges for everyone for taking down the alien base. Lots of money uh, picked up here. Yep, a lot of deaths in that one. Um, Mango, that was all on them. Oh, we could have saved Mango, but they ran away. Um, but overall, a pretty pretty decent mission for uh, all the privates ranked up. Yeah. Everyone did make it to Corporal, but uh, they, they died. <laughs> all right. Thanks everyone for watching. Um, press some buttons, do some things. Uh, we'll catch y'all next time. All right.